hello friends i hope uh, things are okay uh, uh, i'm gonna uh, uh, have a quick look in this video with puppeter uh, i was having issues with installing uh, on uh, installing uh, my uh, backend app on the server side uh, on a VPS. This is a Ubuntu VPS. This is a Ubuntu VPS uh, with uh, 20.0 version. So uh, I just installed it. Uh, I just uh, cloned my repository from GitHub to uh, here and added here an install and then try to uh, try to run uh, my APIs uh, and behind behind that uh, a puppeter process will run but what happens is I got uh, I got errors and the errors were errors were errors were like this very similar actually uh, I, I just solved the issues here, this was the error. Chrome Mosos file directory. I just tried to solve uh, the issues and I solved it. So I thought, why not make a a, a video to just show this uh, show this to you guys how to solve it. So this way you could save your time and stuff like that. So uh, all the way, this is just to help you. So I hope this makes sense. So uh, what I did when I got the error, what I did, I searched over Google and, and then I went to here, the troubleshooting, the puppy, the troubleshooting. I went here and I, I got very similar errors like this. And what I did is, uh, what you have to do is you have to go to the installation directory. I mean, after you install it, the puppy, the Chromium, browser will be automatically installed in your node modules so after that you have to go to the directory okay after that you have to go to the directory in this case here is the directory in this case here is the directory so I went to the directory and then I I hit the, this command and then it show me it shows me the dependencies you must have to go to here i mean the directory uh directory where the chromium is exist so when you go there just simply hit this command and it will show you the dependencies uh, the chrome requires you to be installed so here here are the libraries this needs to be installed so uh so you, what you have to do is just search on Google with this keyword, with this keyword, install. I already installed this. You will see that I got notifications uh, here, just here, and just copy this. You, you don't have to go to inside. It. Just, just that's it. Just copy this. Just copy this and. And put in terminal and then hit enter uh, so yeah here you can see that I did this already yeah ftk uh, install while lib x render to so you could add this y flag this will be a little bit faster and you have to you don't have to give always uh, the permission to it it will automatically be installed and the process will be much faster so you'll see a long list here. I can show you here the list. The list is really long. Uh, you have to uh, uh, copy one by one that. And once you got all of them installed, then come uh, come down, come down. See, I have installed all of them. But what happens again after installing it? You'll see that again. You said the find to run run the browser. So uh i'm sorry oh i'm sorry no this yeah 
after after installing uh, all of the dependencies you will be able to see um, that the chrome browser is running but yes if you uh, as you are not running uh, a, as a root user so you don't have to do uh, you must have to set a flag on on here the flag calls no sandbox and, and, and why you can find it how to set it uh, let's go here and you'll be able to see it yeah it says well you are doing a puppet lens it says no sandbox uh, and, and you might might be needed to use this disable set of you as well but let us try let us try uh, with the first flag and see how it goes so I'm gonna uh, uh, no, actually there there is privacy things my server has a IP address so for the privacy purpose I'm not going to show you my IP address so try with this flag if it doesn't work then add this one as well and afterward I believe that this will work great this will work great so uh, yeah, that's it. I hope I hope uh, uh, the video makes sense and uh, you guys will get help from this video. Thank you so much for watching this. Uh, bye bye.